today we will go over every method in JavaScript arrays. The every method basically tests if all the elements in an array pass a uh, test implemented the pro by the provided function. So also test will return true if all the elements in the array pass the test. Otherwise it will return false. So let us create a variable called result which will contain true or false. And then we'll apply every to array 1, uh, which is just uh, containing the values 2, 3, and 5. So just do the, your variable name dot every. And then inside this, we provide a uh, function name. I have a function called is smaller, which just tests if the value is less than 2. So here, we'll put is smaller so it will automatically call this function and for every value in the array this every method will pass in the first value of the parameter it will pass in the uh, element value and then the index and then the entire array to which every is being applied to in this case array 1 However, uh, for this, I won't use index and array. This was just to let you know. So now, since I'm applying every to all the elements of array one, and it will call is smaller for each value, and then it will test if the value is less than two, since all the elements are more than two or two it will return false so let us also print out the value so I'll open this in the browser it should return false As you can see it returned false. So now if we had it more than or equal to 2, now it should return true since all the items are either 2 or more than 2. So if you open it in your browser again it should turn true now. As you can see so if I put like a 1 here, now it should turn false again. As you can see, it uh, turned uh, false. Also, if you apply a every to an empty function it will return true so for example I have this uh, empty array and then I'm applying every so if you apply this function to an empty array it will return true so if you open this in your browser it should get true as you can see it returned true so that's pretty much it for the every function of JavaScript arrays. It just has to see if all the values in the array passes the uh, test given by the function. Otherwise it will return false. Also for empty arrays it uh, just returns true all the time. So if you like this video Remember to subscribe. If you have any questions, uh, do leave a comment. Thank you.